<laughs> Good morning, you guys. Happy Monday. Happy Monday. It's Monday. Hey, ho, hey, ho. Happy Monday. Hope you guys had a wonderful weekend. <clears throat> I had a pretty good weekend. Um, I did not go to church. Sorry, I look a little crazy today. Um, but I'm just I'm not feeling it. <laughs> uh, I'm praying that the work part of the day just fly by. I really do. When work is over, I'm gonna study my word and go to bed. That's it. That's all. I may watch one or two pictures. If there's one or two available that I like. Meaning YouTubers. And then I'm going to bed. I spent all day yesterday in the bed. I got up long enough to run to the store. I got ground beef. Cat litter. And I had to go to three different stores. That ground beef, cat litter, pulled pork, barbecue sauce, a candle, some cookies, cheesy snacks. Eggs. I think that was it. And a soda. I wanted to get juice, but they only had mango something. I didn't. I wasn't. I don't do mango like that. Um. I think that was it. I got it. Wasn't a lot of stuff at all. Um. And then came home and was just in the bed all day. Um. I tried to edit videos. Saturday's video and one of Friday's videos yesterday and I just kept going to sleep <sighs> like y'all my asthma is just acting crazy with me I went through my inhaler definitely have to get another one and have my nebulizer here I had to get on the machine <laughs> I'm just y'all I'm tired I'm not gonna lie I had a nice time Saturday, but I felt that I was having issues even more so. I had to use my inhaler a couple of times while I was out on Saturday as well. And then um, my tongue felt sore. I was like, when I made the pasta, did I burn my tongue? A couple of times I think I did because I tasted it and it was too hot. I feel so good on my throat. My throat hurts because my throat, the throat has been itching and I keep doing that to scratch it. <clears throat> and now it's really sore. But I got up, I kept, when I did go to sleep, yesterday evening because I slept all day basically so it was hard to sleep in the evening but then when I fell asleep it was off and on off and on and I woke up I think one time around three my tongue was so sore my mouth was dry I have the cough drops I still kept coughing look y'all <laughs> I had them little spots on my tongue all over, and it hurt. <clears throat> and I think the last time I had that, it was um, a virus or something. You know, my body is fighting it, I guess. I don't know. Um, but my tongue is sore for that reason. Like I said, I thought I burnt myself, but it's not. It's the little white dots or spots, and it really hurts. Uh, it's really sore. It's hard to talk. It was hard to sleep um, because 
<coughs> I mean, I was so dry. I can't, couldn't breathe through my nose at all. Like it was so, I couldn't breathe through my nose at all. So my mouth was open. Oh God. And so that's what I dealt with off and on throughout the night. Um, Coach had to wake up and use the inhaler. I just, I don't know. <coughs> I'm so tired. <coughs> so tired. And then you guys, I had this dream. Crazy dream. And the only thing I can remember about the dream is being at some sort of campsite or something with a bunch of kids, right? <coughs> And one of the kids dropped a necklace. Either they did or I did. And it wasn't a necklace. It was a bracelet. or It might have been a necklace. I don't know. In my mind, it looked like a bracelet. I want to say a bracelet. And it was gold and it kind of would shine. You know, sparkle here and there. So when it was dropped, I got under the van to find it. And I looked at it, but I looked at something else, too. I don't know what it was. But whatever I looked at, it was enough for me to get up slowly and tell all the kids, get in the van. Everybody get in the van now. And I was very calm about it. And so they all got in the van and were younger kids. And I was like, put the seatbelts on, lock the doors. And all the doors would lock except one. One kept unlocking and I was like every time that door unlocks lock it just lock it keep it in your mind lock it so I'm backing up out of there and I don't know where I drove to in my mind I think we ended up I don't know where we drove to but it, we, we, were, we, were, we were on a a block Reminded me of Huron, and I guess I always say Huron because that's always what comes up in my dream. Because maybe that's what I was used to, I don't know. But Huron or uh, Harrison, um, but again, it was a it block similar, I guess. I don't know, but that's what was in my dream. And we, I don't know what was going on, I don't know if it was the kids that I had in the van. All I know is there were kids and people out around. And I was trying to explain something to them. I don't know what it was. But I was also trying to tell everybody to keep calm. It's going to be all right. Ah, and one of the kids started crying. They were in pain. And, and they was looking all crazy. And all of a sudden, something started to come out their ear. So it was like. Something was coming out of the ear, it looked like worms or something just started coming out of and this was a little boy out of his ears. And then he's looking at me all crazy and strange, like, uh oh. and I was like, It's gonna be alright, calm down, calm down. And all of a sudden, as he's staring at me, his eyes began to water and then all of a sudden flies started coming out of his eyes. Not a bunch, it was like one at a time, two at a time, you know, but just come out his eyes and he's crying and I'm trying to figure out what in the heck what you know what is going on um and then another kid began to scream and something began to come out of this kid um I don't know if it was the mouth the eyes or what but that's that is what was going on um I don't think that there were any adults experiencing this I think that there were some adults around because there were people around um, but that's all I remember of the dream when I woke up. That's all I remember. <sighs> My coffee is so good, but I gotta put some heat on it. <laughs> that is all I remember of the dream. That is it. That is all. I don't know. I think once before in the dream while we were driving, I had that bracelet in my hand, was holding it up, looking at it. Or while we were on the on the street, the block, I don't know. But I remember holding that bracelet up and looking at it again for some reason. Um, I don't know. 
I don't know if, if when we were in the van, I kept saying, make sure to lock that door if it unlocks. I don't know if something was on the side of us, something was trying to get in. I honestly don't remember anything except what I just said. And I didn't think I was going to remember that. Like, I was going to get up throughout the night and just turn the recorder on and record the dream. But then I was too tired to even do that. I was just like, I hope I remember. <laughs> I just was too tired. I didn't want to do anything. Like, yesterday, honestly, I slept or laid here all day. All day. All day. I got up long enough, like I said, to go to the store. Uh, I came back. I cleaned up. I cleaned the cat litter box. I washed it out, put fresh cat litter in there. Um, I made tacos for Jay. Um added some meat in the um, pasta for me uh, <clears throat> and that was it all day I just sat here um, or I lay here I got up long enough a couple of times to eat something um, and that was hard because of my tongue was hurting um, I watched John Wick 4 it was it was very good I watched I forget the name of it, but it was like a dragon, you know, picture for kids, pretty much. You know, it, it was a little boy who uh, was the king <laughs> of an underground society or whatever, and uh, he had to go through these riddles, but you know, solve these riddles, put these pieces together and and turn back the clock or something um, in order to go home, in order to set things right because the underground and the above ground used to all be uh, together and, and when the, something came along, I forgot the name of it, but it was basically fear um, he had messed all of that up and so long story short, the sister that was with him the whole time. I thought it was something strange about this child. But the sister in the dream in the in the picture was, was already dead. This little sister had passed away. But in the way it started off, you I didn't think that was I didn't know that was the case. This little sister had passed away. It wasn't until the end of the movie that we saw that she was not real that she you know was not alive and I thought that was pretty good for me to go that whole movie all the way up until the end before I found out that the child was not that she was uh dead <laughs> um but anyway it was really good I can't remember the name of it <clears throat> yeah I'm coming to y'all early too it's Six something, it's six forty-seven now. I've been talking to you for thirteen minutes, and prior to that, I just been sitting here like, like I said, I'm not gonna take off anymore. <clears throat> I really got things I have to do, and I shouldn't have, you know, did the VTO as many times as I did last week because I know I have things to do. Um, but it was hard, like. And regardless of how hard it, how hard it is, <clears throat> I have to come on and get it together. I really do because I got things to do. You know, nobody's going to do it for me. I have to get on the ball. And it's hard. I'm not going to lie. <sighs> you know, you have a weight on you <sighs> for so many different reasons. It's tough. It really is. And uh, all you can do is... is just keep moving forward and trust God, you know. Um, I feel bad. I didn't go to church yesterday, but I just, I couldn't. We're going to sit up around people like that, you know, and not feel good and be coughing and coughing and not really knowing what the issue is. I just can't do that. I'm just going to do what I did, get some rest. I know my sister didn't go because her back was, man, 
It's been a long time since I've seen her in that much pain. The movie I watched was called The Secret Kingdom. That's what I watched. It was it was pretty good. I don't know if y'all can see that. It was good. I watched that. I watched John Wick 4, like I said. Pretty good. John Wick 4. And uh, I think that's all I watched yesterday. Hey guys, <clears throat> I went ahead and took off. I'm just, I can't. Um, I'm finna lay down. It is 7.51 a.m. I'm gonna lay back down. When I do get up, I'm gonna study my word. I have got some more color pins. I have my Bible and everything right here next to me. Bible. <coughs> Got a notepad. <coughs> I'm going to write down all my bills that's due this week. I don't know if y'all can see because I have the lights off. But, whoops. I have everything right here next to the bed that I don't need. <sighs> but yeah, I'm, I'm just gonna lay down. My <sighs> tongue is a little bit better. <sighs> but I'm gonna just lay here and get some rest. And then, uh, like I said, when I get up a little bit later, <sighs> get my word in. Um, definitely want to wipe wipe down the uh, couches again because of Chapo <clears throat> and vacuums. I don't know if <sighs> I want to say a lot of my allergies are because of Chapo. Uh, I know Jeremiah, he's affecting Jeremiah too, but I don't know. I don't know, guys. Um, I know it has nothing to do with me constantly being sick off and on. And uh, I'm going to definitely try to work on that. Um, may, you know, maybe eating a lot better. I'm a lot more healthier. Just continue to drink more and more water. Only have my coffee in the morning. That's it. Um, if I have to reheat it, that's fine. But once that cup is gone, that's it. Just water throughout the rest of the day. <coughs> I've had to have been craving acid a lot lately. But I'm going to try to stick with the water. <sighs> try to eliminate the bread. Been uh, eating a lot of bread lately. Making myself sandwiches because I'm too lazy to cook or whatever. Um, but yeah, starting today actually I'm going to have to do that. I haven't eaten breakfast or anything. I just have my cup of coffee. I'm going to finish this cup of coffee. I just reheated it a second time. My throat itches so much. Like I just want to... I just want to scratch it. I'm not going to keep doing that thing with my tongue because it's making my throat sore and it makes me cough too I, I think because my throat is so dry I don't know even though I keep drinking liquid um but yeah I'm gonna like I said I lay here uh if Jeremiah goes out I have him get me a can of soup uh that's what I should have got yesterday but I did not maybe if I feel better I'll get up and go get me a can of soup a list filled try y'all no <clears throat> but while I'm breathing okay I took a hot bath <coughs> I took a hot bath and uh 
Now my nose is starting to get clogged up again. See, that's the problem. I'm going off and on. Like, now my nose is starting to get clogged up again in here. Um, I'm breathing better, but now the coughing is starting up again. Um, I showed y'all my inhaler last night. Yeah, it's on zero. So let's go to show how much I've been using it. It says zero, but it has a little bit left in there. Do my best to not use it at all. Um, like, look at my face. I got little spots breaking out. Like, I don't know what what's happened between. Like Saturday, my my asthma was getting bad. Yes, I was having a good time, dancing around, all this and that and the other. Had to use my inhaler a couple of times. But then Saturday night, I started to feel bad. And then Sunday, I was worse. Um, when I got up this morning, the mid part of my back, like, I don't know. And I'm only sharing this. I'm not complaining. <clears throat> I've shared it because I'm sure I'm not the only one who's going through some things. And uh, God is good. So regardless of what I'm going through right now, oh, it is definitely right now. It's just a moment in time, and it's not gonna last long, you know. I just know I'm not gonna be a hundred percent trying to work today, and I want to give a hundred percent. So I'm gonna take this day. I'm gonna lay my butt down and relax. Come tomorrow, I gotta get on it. Gotta get on it. I have to get on it. Um. I have things that I really need to do. Oh, so I really do need to get on it. Anyway, you guys, have a great morning. I'll talk to you later um, in the day. Um, yeah, bye. Y'all, I'm up again. I'm so tired. I can't even go to sleep. <laughs> I just went through this sneezing fit and now my nose keeps running and won't stop I'm stopped up again like yeah oh, no matter how much I blow it oh, oh, no matter how much I blow it it keeps running like water so stopped up up in here. Oh, keep going through these sneezing fits. Oh my God, I'm just so I'm so over this man. Like I said, I'm not complaining. I just gotta get over this. Especially by tomorrow. I have to. I'm so tired. I'm going to try to lay down yet again. My tongue still hurts. Oh. Oh. Oh, guys. Gosh. Gonna try again, okay. El Chapo, I had to lock him in the bathroom, but Jeremiah ended up going in there, used the bathroom, we'll let him out, didn't put him back in. Only because he keeps scratching at the door. So I opened the door to let him in, but then he just wants to jump in the window, drink the plant water, and then eventually, by accident, most likely knock the plant water over. All on these on these electrical outlets. I cannot allow that. So every time he comes over here, I have to shoo him away. So this is what he is doing right now. <laughs> He's just sitting there. I either waiting for me to go to sleep or something. I don't know. But as long as he stay right there, we okay. Because I'm just, I'm tired. I just want to lay down. 
and be able to breathe better. Whew. This is crazy. This really is. Then I got my towel rag because I'm going through these bad, bad boys, but I rather use these than constantly going through all the tissue. And these are simple rags, really, actually rags, not towels, but rags. And look at this, y'all. I've gone through one, two, three, and one is in the living room. Like, oh, did I throw my nose on my blanket? Not the state, Jesus. Oh, I'm just over it. <laughs> so over it. Oh, I'm gonna try again, y'all. Please pray for me. <laughs> Could be worse. I'm not complaining. I keep saying that because I'm not. I just. Man. I just got some good news too, by the way, for my son. Like I said, good things. I'm expecting great things to happen. And he just gave me some great news. And I'm so happy. Uh, looks like he'll be mobile mobile again. I'm so happy about that. Uh, just waiting to know for sure. But God is good. God is so good, y'all. God is amazing. <laughs> I was sitting here, I was trying to get some sleep, I was on the computer looking up some stuff, and I was just having a hard time resetting passwords, this, that, and the other, and that's when I got the message from him, and I was finally able to reset my password, and I was like, okay, now I'm just going to lay down, because I'm so, look, so you figure I ain't paying attention no more, huh? <laughs> This cat. Now, if he stay right there, it wouldn't be a problem. But I know him. He's going to try to get in that window. In that water. And that's, that's the issue with this cat. Oh, he's so hard-headed. Oh. I know he's not going to stay put. I know he's not. But we're going to see. We're going to see. Anyway, y'all, my background is crazy. I'm sorry. <coughs> Nothing I can do about it right now. <clears throat> you hear that? I'm sniffing and I can't even. It's all right here. think after all of that it wouldn't be anything left in my nose to blow oh uh, you know what <laughs> I forgot It does look like it was crooked there for a bit. Oh, I forgot about this. I used it last night. Oh. This is my Vicks inhaler. I used to be so addicted to these when I was younger. Because my nose would be so stopped up. Even back then. Now this one. It was no problem. But this one. So stopped up. Hopefully this will work. It opened me up a bit more. Oh, oh gosh.
9.26. Oh, my nose burn. Only because of blowing and rubbing. All this is starting to get red. I forgot about that. Oh. Oh, hurt. Everything hurts. Oh, gosh. I'm going to lay down, guys. I'm just trying to lay down. I got to pee again. I'm so tired. I'm so tired. Uh, I didn't finish my coffee. Ah, ah. Play on with you. Yeah, as soon as I feel better, I'm gonna get up, wipe everything down, <coughs> vacuum, <sighs> and then get in my work. <sighs> For now, I'm just gonna try to go to sleep. I'm gonna talk to y'all later.